My name is Bill Berger, co-owner of BMR Racing in this 93 box body Mustang that we use in endurance road racing. Today we're gonna to put the engine in. Um, it's finally going in, make it a whole car. We've gone from a stock 220 horsepower on a good day 5.0 Mustang to a 577 horsepower 363 cubic inch Ford small block. When we started racing AER, we were um, probably in the lead of our class, but the speed creep in that racing series has, has been, it's been going up real fast. Uh, the level of cars, the level of drivers have just gotten so much faster. We found ourselves at the end of our class. And uh, we were aiming for, you know, getting back up to the front of class three where we were. And so far we've ended up, we're, now we're aiming for class five, which is the fastest class. The engine was built by uh, Pat and Mike at Engine Power at Power Nation. It is a 363 cubic inch Windsor-based Ford small block. Dart block, trick flow heads, intake. It's got Holly Sniper fuel injection system on it. The whole belt drive system is by Jones Racing. It's quite the piece. Obviously, when we talked to Pat and Mike, we had some stipulations where it has to last. I mean, we do eight and a half, 14 hours, possibly we might do some 24 hour races. It has to last the whole thing or it's, there's no reason even starting. So we, we, get, we told them we needed somewhere between 575 and 600 horsepower. It needed to last, it needed to run on pump gas and it needed to be able to rev to somewhere around 8,000 RPMs. And they did that with flying colors. And the front suspension is a complete QA1 tubular front cross member coilover suspension system with uh, dual adjustable coilovers. The rear suspension is out of a 2003 Cobra that we've upgraded with QA1 rear adjustable shocks. We're gonna have multiple differentials with different gear ratios and for different tracks. Being able to change out just the pumpkin is going to be huge and make it more uh, tunable per track. We're running Motegi wheels and Cooper tires. Tires are a, and wheels are a big thing. Um, you gotta have tires that are gonna last through the whole race. If not, you gotta pull off track, change tires, and you don't wanna have to do that. Uh, Will Wood stepped up and we have this complete Will Wood brake system. Um, obviously, they've gotta last. You can't change brake pads in the middle of a race. We got the AEM data acquisition system. It does two things, it does data, but it also becomes our gauges. The nice thing about it is that you can tune it for whatever you want. You can add brake pressure, you can add fuel pressure, oil pressure, I mean anything. You just add it on and you can set up the dash to show whatever you want. It's completely tunable and um, customizable. So it's a thoroughbred now.